hope you're all doing well. Thank you for tuning in. We're looking at another 3D illustration I did, this time of a triangular shaped object west of Kowalski in the southern mid latitudes of Mars in a region called Terra Serenum. The JP2 we're analyzing in this one is called Intersecting Rabin, acquired on the 11th of February 2010 at 51.1 centimeters per pixel. 2x2 two two binning was used and as usual I'm showing you an image cropped from the JP2 black and white map projected file. There's a look at the low res black and white and the object we'll be focusing on is located roughly in this region of the photograph. We'll zoom in on that object located right there at 30 degrees 1 minute south, 148 degrees 47 minutes west. And we have Kowalski over here to the east, about 300 kilometers from that site. The object we're zooming in on is located right there in the center of the image. It's about 20 meters across and a close-up reveals the strange triangular shape, slightly rounded corners, and it's got two slots in it. And on top, it's difficult to make out, we've got two sort of dome-like raised areas. There's also weird debris close by. It looks like the triangular object is leaning on top of a boulder. And there's the 3D illustration that I did using Adobe Dimension. This approximates what I think we might be looking at. Obviously because there's no side view of this object, it's difficult to say whether this is exactly what it looks like. As I say, I'm only speculating. So let me know what you guys and girls make of this one. Are we looking at some wreckage, maybe some type of craft or structure, or just an object that was formed through some other natural geology? Right, let's zoom down to Terra Serenum and the site where we discovered this strange object. There's the photograph we analyzed, intersecting Graben. And if you want to view the high-res detail of this site, download the original JP2. I'll include the link to the original NASA page in the description below. As you can see, Google Earth Mars is very low resolution. And there's a look at that strange triangular object and some of the other anomalies close by. Got this rectangular slab. It looks like it might be lying on another block underneath it. And then this strange object, it looks like some type of wreckage, maybe a sculpted piece, who knows, that there's also about 20 meters across. The uh, rectangular object there is also about 15 to 20 meters long. Right, so let's zoom out and check out some other sites close by. Here we're looking at anomalies found in Bernard Crater. Looks like we might have an opening in the side of whatever that is. It also has a small rectangular opening over there on the edge. Don't know what we're looking at there folks. And then that strange object about 10 meters across and it's got what looks like a rectangular opening in it. also looks highly reflective, almost metallic in nature. 
as always, let's have a chat in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you think of this anomaly and also those that we had a look at at sites close by. Are we looking at some type of craftier folks, some type of intelligent design, or is it just a freak of nature? Thanks for watching, folks, and to my new subscribers who joined recently, welcome on board. Take care. Until the next video, ciao for now.